Hey, over there at Frankowski Construction, this is Doc Key from Master Flying Billboards. I want to thank Danny for allowing me to send this video out to you guys. So real quickly, I don't want to waste you guys' time and waste my time as well. Uh, I'm going to be giving you guys three tips and tricks that you use that you can use today to really optimize your traffic and bring more customers to your business online. I'm going to be comparing you and competing against your competition and showing you how to beat them. Uh, so real quickly, I'm going to be covering three things, content, citations, and backlinks. So basically what content is, uh, anything that you see on your front page as far as text, uh, images, what those images are saved as, any videos, what those videos may be saved as. And Google typically wants to see about 1,500 keywords of content on your front page. So if we put you guys into this word count in here, we see that you guys have 105 words on your front page. So, you know, you guys have a little bit of content. You just definitely want to go out there and put a bunch more content on your front page. This will allow Google to understand and know exactly what is it that you do. Uh, content within itself is not uh, a ranking factor at all. But it's highly recommended to have this amount of content because you want to target keywords. And what we mean by keywords is by intent keywords. So example of a keyword was to be if we was to type into uh, Google, uh, excuse me, uh, construction companies, New Jersey, right? If we was to type this into Google, then you will see that we have some sections here that pop up. So we're focusing on this organic section here. You see that these guys are being found for that keyword, fencing construction, who are also one of your competitors. And, uh, there's a few others here, right? All, and so obvious in Eminem Construction, I also pulled these guys up. And they're in the 10th place. It's going to be easy to come in here and beat these guys. So I'm going to compare you to them and show you how you guys can go out there and beat them. Uh, I've, like I said, obviously being in one of these positions here is bringing in a lot of traffic. So this is a software I like to use called Ahrefs. And what this software allows me to do is to see the keywords that you guys are using and the traffic that you're getting to your website. So we see that you guys here are using 105 keywords on your page so typically what I always do when I come in to the software I just narrow it down I filter it out and I will continue to filter these these sections out right here and I go and get the best keywords so as you see you guys are using these keywords and I usually do this process because these are the keywords that you're going to easily rank for no problem no hassle and but I, you guys are using these keywords and guess what you guys are in first place for your uh, construction for your company it receives 10 volume right uh, this right 10 volume so but really what you want to do is that uh, you see these other keywords, they're not by intent. You know, this is Dodge Street, East Orange, New Jersey. That doesn't necessarily mean that someone is looking for a construction company. You want these keywords to be by intent. So what this software allows us to do, and these are one of your competitors here as well. Like I said, Google wants to see about 1,500 keywords on your front page. So if we put these guys into the word account, you'll see that they have 935 words. It's going to be easy to go out there and beat them out, guys out. Just go ahead and get that uh, content, and you guys start beating them out. Uh, you see, as you can see, this is the back end of their page. They're using 586 keywords. Uh, they're getting a, a traffic value of 315 searches every month. Now, this is a software. The software is more accurate than it's not. So I imagine that these guys are getting slightly bit uh, or more than that, and uh, you guys as well. But, however, these are uh, more, these uh, metrics are precise. So, However, like, like we said, we can go in here and we can see what organic keywords these guys are ranking for. So we're going to filter out. We're going to go through the same process, and I'm going to show you guys some, some of the keywords that you might be ranking for. And if these guys don't have good keywords, we can go out there and find some really, really good keywords for you guys. I work with construction companies in Rochester. I have, I'm have i working with some in, in Jersey and Newark as well, and I'm, I'm pulling up these keywords all the time for these guys. So so example would be, uh, let's just find one real quickly, Top Construction Company, New Jersey, right? It gets a search volume of 50. Uh, it's, it's, it's very hard to rank for, so this is not something that we would target. They're in the 30th position. They're not going to doing good as well. So depending on you guys' services, roofing company, New Jersey, you want to be using keywords like this. Trust me, I have much, much more better keywords than this. I don't go after anything that's above a file. Anything, you're going to be knocking out third graders if you could go from zero to, to, to five within that uh, keyword difficulty uh, uh, category right here. So that's an example of content and keywords. Like I said, when you're using these keywords, you want to be being found for something like uh, construction companies, New Jersey, if you guys are looking to uh, grow that. Uh, you want to be using that on your front page. You want to be highlighting them, bold them. You want to be saving these images as keywords. As you can see, this says Slotter 21. This should be saved as a keyword you're trying to be found for. Perhaps you guys offer many different services. So you want to put maybe, if you guys do electrical service, electric company, East Orange, New Jersey, you got, Google is going to rank you for that. So like I said, this is the back end of these guys' page, and these are number one of your uh, competitors, m and Construction, right? And they're, they're fairly large as well. As you see, these guys, again, 221, they're using 112 keywords, right? So the thing is that uh, keywords, it doesn't matter how many keywords you're using. Uh, you guys are using much more than them, but you see they're getting a, a bit of traffic value. Uh, they, they, their metrics is not 100% as well, 
So I'm just going to show you how you can go ahead and beat these guys out. So the second thing that we want to talk about today is uh, citations. And citations is basically anything that you see on the web for that 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 allows you to list your name, address, your business name, address, phone number, company, uh, all of this description and etc. And et uh, so basically, the citations are anything like Yex, Yellow Yellow Pages, White Pages, Facebooks, Angie List, Home Advisor. Uh, those are uh, company di directories that people list in to get you know leads or customers or whatever but there are many many more besides that specific uh citation that you guys should list in so a way i go about to get these citations is a, a software called whitespark.ca and it allows me to put a company's uh, uh domain and then another company's domain basically their competitors and we go get the citations that they have and we just complete uh, repeat that process until we have the most citations citations are very important because it builds credibility with you and google so uh and it allows you to rank in this section this section is called the map section right the gmb section this section is called i call it the nap section the name address and phone number section so you see these guys right here running ads they're not at the top these guys are at the top so if we click on these guys profile right what you want to go ahead and do and optimize this to be found in this section and this section is responsible for four 44% of traffic that comes so it's very important to be listed here you want to optimize this you want to get uh, uh you want to maximize this at 700 characters you want to get go out and get some more some reviews uh, because Google uh they rate you for all of these things and they want to you also want to be optimizing these photos with keywords by intent keywords key phrases key terms that you're trying to be found for as an example as I showed you guys with this uh, keyword as well so uh, that's that's the thing with citations so content citations and the last thing I want to talk about is backlinks so as I can see right here, backlinks is basically anything that any website, any domain that links back to your website that passes it power. Uh, you guys have about 16 referring domains. You guys can have a lot more. Like I said, this is this is a huge factor, but because they have your your big these company have 586 doesn't necessarily mean you need five. You just need ones that's targeting specific areas and specific services, right? Uh, but this is a huge factor as well because this was what passed you power So this may be a reason why these guys are beating you and they're getting getting all these traffic If we go into the page right they might have some uh, service areas or uh, certain things like that They got a uh, hub page, which is a blog So they're receiving traffic from that and this bringing in a lot of traffic for their business So, you know the good thing about that is that we're able to go in here and see what uh, backlinks these guys have and we're able to take some for ourselves they have 137 but are only 85 of them, uh, of them are do follow which will be the ones that you will focus on and you'll go out there and beat them in that so you just want to have that content you want to have that buy in 10 keywords i can give you guys some examples from keywords here actually north construction because as you can see this has a total and this is just in north alone right it has a total search of 570 uh searches per month so if you go in here and use these like i said i don't use anything over five if you're going to use these, you're going to rank for these. If you use them correctly, right? And you, if you guys want to rank in different cities and areas, you want to use that as well. So what's interesting, real quickly, I don't want to keep you guys too long. I was able to come into your website, and I see that you guys have a second page. Now, see the example of this? This is the example of this. So I imagine that you guys are getting traffic to this website from your main domain. However, if you optimize this website alone, you'll receive much more traffic for uh, South Jersey as well. That you just want to go and get them domains and focus strictly on this it would increase your business tenfold like, this is very interesting to me because i actually just uh identified this you want to have more trap uh, more um keywords here and, and all of those things so that's basically what i have for you guys today content you want to use that them keywords uh citations you want to go get listed with them citations uh take advantage of those networks and also backlinks so uh soft i use it's called this is a trust this allow me to uh, get backlinks also as well but it's consolidated so i love to use this 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 particular software but one i use to go and get the backlinks also is uh, called majestic.com so i hope you guys found this information useful and you're able to utilize it like i said the most important thing that you can do today is optimize this front page make this very clickable so people could call you right it's clickable you want to put a, a, a form submit here because people you love uh user uh, user ability where someone can do come do something pretty simply and contact the business owner but the most important thing is that i found this website here you want to optimize this page this page is going to bring you a ton of traffic just like your other pages and you're not going to have to receive traffic from that page for this page uh this is going to be all for south jersey and i see that this is south shore so i hope you guys take care man and uh you guys can reach out to me uh, if you have any questions or concerns thank you